Hello everyone, um, welcome to my unboxing of Sungwoo's newest, or I guess not newest album, his debut solo album. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Um, I've been waiting for this for so long. As you know, Victon is like literally skyrocketed up my bias list. They are my second favorite group of all time right now. Um, and when I heard that Sungu was going to be dropping a solo album, you better believe I said I was going to buy it. Um, I wasn't expecting it to be three versions. However, I'm not too mad about it. They are beautiful. Um, I love the colors in all of them. I love the concept for all of them, the photo cards. A couple of them are hilarious. So I'm hoping I pull some of those, but let's begin. I'm so excited. Oh my God. So we have the Han Sung Woo versions. Um, we'll go in order, I guess. And yeah, I'm so excited. So let me move these two out of the way for now. This is so exciting. Okay, so should I zoom in a little bit? Maybe. Also, just a disclaimer, there's some construction going on outside. So if you hear that, it is what it is. Um, so yeah, let's get the plastic off of here. So here we go. There is the front the back the track list i've listened to the album i can't even tell you which one is my favorite i love them all so much the title track though sacrifice is fantastic i love the colors we've got going on here with the lime like yellowy green i feel like it really bounces off of the blue color really well so there's the spine and then as you can see that neon color has been brought all the way around and then here it says han for the han version okay um Oh my gosh so the photo cards i believe when i watch an unboxing are like literally right up at the top so i'm gonna open it upside down which might be uh scary because everything's gonna fall out maybe but that's what we're gonna do because i don't want to see anything okay so here we have the photo book first yeah so everything is like there so here we have the photo book let's go through that i'm just gonna move this out of the way for now just in the corner there and uh yeah let's do this should I talk through it? Let's talk through it this time. Sometimes I do like a fast forward, but I think I want to talk about this album a little bit. So Sungwoo is not my bias from Victon, and I think majority of you do know that. However, because they are literally my second alt group, um, ooh, um, I will support them in every way possible. No matter which member drops any solo album or anything at all, I will support it. So. Um, and also after X1, <laughs> I will support Sun Moon everything that he does. Um, he was basically the reason that I even discovered Victon, and that was because of X1 um, and watching produce X101. Um, he wasn't my bias from X1, however, he did open my eyes to Victon because I think it was while he was on the show or right after, that's when Victon dropped Nostalgic Night, which was the first song that I heard by them. Um, and that really got me to love them. I listened to that song on repeat for so long. So yeah, this photo book is beautiful. I love this concept. I can't remember, I think I said that this one was my favorite, but in terms of like the packaging, I don't know. I think I think it's a different one. Not the, not Wu, I think it might be, it's either Han or Sung version that were my favorite just based on the cover and the concept photos. Um, but yeah, so this is a beautiful photo book. It's like nice and small, compact, compact um and not too thick which is nice but there's still like quite a lot of photos in here like there's not a lot of like blank pages or anything you know so that's nice and yes yeah, so that's the back so yeah it's pretty small like here's my hand but i'm okay with that i like small and compact when i saw that it was in a box packaging i'm like oh shit I don't, i'm not gonna have room for that but i do and i really love these colors and then there's the spine in case you needed to see that as well so that was the photo book um, we can bring this back into frame. Now I can put things back in the way they were. There we go, let's do that. So uh, I don't wanna see anything. I hope nothing's flipped over. I think we're good, I think we're good. Okay, so we'll look at the postcards. So here is the first one. There's the back, there's the front. Oh, that's beautiful. I love that. There's something about like one hand covering the face that like does it for me. I don't know, I'm gonna leave it out because I do wanna put these in binders later. Um, and then here's the second postcard. And we have, ooh, we have this one. They match really well too. So they'll look nice on a two pocket page. I don't know if these will fit in three pockets. They might, we'll try, but ah, so beautiful. Okay, so there's that. Um, and then next up, I guess, should we look at the little tag thingy? 
Let's look at the little tag thingy. Oh my gosh, okay, so first of all, a little sticker. Oh my God, I got the heart one. Ah, I wanted the heart one. This is so cute. So it's made to look like a little Instagram post. I love it. And there it is in this little heart. So I think these counted as like photo cards, if I remember correctly, from the, um, the what's it called, album details, but I don't know. But yeah, and then is this a sticker or is this just like, no, okay. I was like, are they gonna make me take it apart to use a sticker if I wanted to? But no, it's just like a little tag. But I love the colors of this one like a lot. So anyways, there's that. So I'm just gonna leave that there so you can see it, but I won't pack it away. Um, okay, and then we have a photo card. Oh my gosh, actually let's do that last because there are some other things in here first, pre-order and CD. So let's look at the CD. The CD does come in a jewel case in the box, which I don't hate it. As long as it wasn't just a jewel case, I'm not too mad. Um, I did see an unboxing of this and somebody opened it up, the, the little whatever this is, CD booklet. It's literally just a track list and um, lyrics on white pages with black text, like it's nothing special. So I'm not gonna open it, but I love this cover. And I like that it's a nice little like thin jewel case. So I'm gonna pop that there. Let's put you there. There we go. You have to see his face though. There we go, cute. Okay, now we can look at the pre-order stuff. So this will be the same in every single album. So I'm gonna have multiples of these. So I'll probably sell them or something eventually. I don't know yet, but here is the postcard, the pre-order postcard super cute oh my god i love this so much um put that up there can you see it no uh, let's put it there sure um and then the pre-order photo cards look like this super cute love that so there are those oh let's put you there i guess and then last but not least so <laughs> from this album i really 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 want the photo cards that are like close up of his eyeballs don't know if this is gonna be it though. Let's see, one, two, three. It's not, but that's okay. I actually really like this photo card. Um, and I'm not planning on collecting all photo cards for this album because there are too many, <laughs> but I'm just gonna keep what I pull. So that's cute. I like that one. If I do, oh, I choked. If I do happen to see the one of his eyeballs for cheap, I'll buy it, but I doubt it. I feel like it's gonna be one of those ones that goes for a lot of money for no reason. Um, and then there is like a cover that was there if you just opened it properly, but I didn't wanna see anything. So there's that. So that is the Han version. Oh, there's like a little thing. What does that say? Sometimes I can feel your eyes. Ooh, dramatic. Um, so yeah, that was the first version, the Han version. And now we can move on to the Sung version. Okay, so here we have the Sung version of the album. I think I like this cover and the colors the most. I don't know. I really like the lime color on the other, or like neon color. Um, I didn't even cut that, out. wow. Um, but I do like the simplicity of this one. And I think if he were to do like signed M-Wave copies, which maybe it might happen, um, this would, would look the best. So there's that. Um, so there's the front. Take a look at that. I kind of wish they did like a little magnet for the opening, but they didn't, but it's fine. Mine just feels a little uh, bent. Like it could be a little bit more, you know, in, if that makes sense. But anyway, there's the spine, there is the back. And then the same as before, this time it is purple. Oh, you can hear everything rattling. And then it says, so super exciting. Okay, uh, again, we're gonna open it upside down. I almost forgot. So let's do that. Fun, okay. I don't know how much more talking I'm gonna be able to do through these flip throughs, but we're gonna try. So here we go. So this is the Sung version photo book. I just really like simple photos like this with like a nice clean, plain background. Ooh, why do I love that? Just like a picture of hands, you know what I mean? Like little simple things like that are just beautiful to me. Like I think this whole concept is gorgeous. I love it. I don't know how I feel about his hair at times. Here it's fine, but in the music video, there were moments where I was like, what is going on? Oh, I love these hand photos. Am I weird? I might be a little weird. This one too, like just the angle. <laughs> I'm finding weird things to talk about now. There we go. There's that like hand over the face thing that I was talking about that I liked before. I think this is the postcard that I got in the other one, isn't it? Um, but yeah, I don't know. This, this photo book is just so like, there's not, 
much to it, but not in a bad way. Like they didn't, ooh, black and white. Are we getting, we're getting black and white photography. I love black and white photography. Okay, this might be my favorite version. I think it might be. I liked the fun uh, concept photos from the first one, but I really love how clean and I don't know, simple this is. And I love black and white photography. I always comment on black and white photography. He has really pretty hands. Is that like a weird thing to, to like in a person? <laughs> Is that a weird feature? I don't know, but well, he's just, he is a beautiful person. Sorry, there's a bit of a glare. There's not really much I can do about that. The sun is out today, but I love his tattoo as well. Really nice placement <laughs> and it was done well. Has nice clean lines. Sorry about that construction. If you can hear it, it is what it is. There we go. And that was the end of that photo book but yeah so again this one has a purple spine there's the cover super cute what does the inside of this spine say it says i just want to stay here or sorry i just want to stay there all i want is to stay there hmm interesting let's make sure none of the photo cards are perfect okay so let's look at these postcards one two three oh no i got the same ones okay so i'm gonna have to or at least one of them's the same I'm gonna have to trade that but i do have um a couple friends who, uh, who have bought this album as well. So definitely trade potential. Oh no, this one's a little dinged. Not bad though. One, two, three. Oh, this one's different. Beautiful. I love this. It's black and white. It's everything I want. <laughs> so yeah, we'll keep that. Um, let's do the CD next this time. So there we go. Again, just a little jewel case with a different cover this time. Super beautiful. These would be really nice to just like display on a shelf or something as well if you didn't have room for like the full album. So there's that. Should I move over a bit? There we go. There's that. Um, and then I guess we'll look at the pre-order again, even though they're the exact same. I'm pretty sure it was just these. And now there's a loud car. Is it gonna pass? Please pass. Okay, it passed, I think. But yeah, so these are the same pre-order. No, it didn't. These are the same pre-order benefits from the first album. So nothing different there. Backs are the same. So yeah, I will have extras of these, which is okay. So there's that. And then we can look at this little tag photo card thing. Oh my God, it's so cute. <laughs> I love it. I wish I could like re, or do they all say the same thing? I have to double check with the other one. It probably does. It just looks like a hashtag of each of the songs on the album, but I love that, that's so cute. And then there's the back. And then the little sticker thingy, not sticker. I keep saying it's a sticker, it's not, it's just a tag. Um, I don't love tag things like this that come in albums, but these are so cute. I'll find a way to display them nicely. So there is that. And then last but not least, we have the photo card. One, two, three. Oh, this one's cute too. It kind of matches, does it match my other one? No, it doesn't, I'm a liar. <laughs> but I really like these. Oh, that's so cute, his little heart. Man, that's a big heart. His are like, <laughs> his looks like this. Mine are like little teeny things. He's got, I'm telling you, he's got nice hands. Anyway, <laughs> moving on. Oh yeah, the little cover. Ooh, I like that. That's pretty. Eyes closed, simple and clean. This is my aesthetic. So yeah, that was the sung version of the album. And now we can move this out of frame and go on to the last one, the Wu version, which I'm sure is a lot of people's favorites for reasons that you will soon find out. Okay, so last but not least, we have the Wu version of the album. So let's cut that open. This time I actually will cut it. There we go. So let's get him open. go so there is the front the back the spine and then the rest of the spine i don't know if i love ooh, this one says woo i like this color blue i don't know if i love it on top of this red from a design perspective it hurts my eyes to read but that's just me we have a nice shot of his tattoo um but yes let's open this up upside down as well Fun. and this little spine message says I just want to love I just want sorry I can't read it says I just want love I just want love not I just want to love <laughs> anyway 
Um, okay, so we'll start with the photo book. Move you off to the side for a moment. And yeah, so this one's nice and red. Let's see. Okay, let's begin. So this, <laughs> this you'll soon find out this, this is why this version is many people's favorites, which I understand completely. However, <laughs> I don't want it to be my favorite just because he's exposed, okay? While it is wonderful to look at, I think I still prefer the simple and clean <laughs> version of the album. <laughs> and that's just me. But these are beautiful. Love it. I love this undercut hair hairstyle as well. Really suits him, so. But yeah, he, uh, he really went for it. I love this because of the way that it's framed and the ph photography style. Like, I don't know if you can see, but the way the light is shining, it's like highlighting his tattoo. Fantastic photography. So, it's the same with here, like how it just highlights his eyes. Love that. But yeah. Everyone's favorite for obvious reasons. <laughs> there we go. I don't know what else to say other than uh, the obvious. So, <laughs> yeah, this album, let's just say, is probably the more um, seductive of the three. Let's say that. Is that a good word? Seductive. I love this profile shot. His hair is looking a little crazy, but I love the profile. So there's that. There's also like little hints of lyrics and things throughout these photo books, which I really enjoy. So that's nice. Ooh, I like the, um, see here the red and the blue kind of nicely play off each other. I think it's with the text. It just makes it hard to read, but with the photos, it looks great. So there's that. And there's that. So that is that photo book. And there's the back and there's the blue spine. So yeah, there's that. So now we can look at the other things. So we'll look at the postcards first. Let's make sure everything's upside down. This is not, but we're just gonna quickly, duh, there we go. So postcard number one, let's pray for non-duplicates. <laughs> one, two, three, damn it, we got a duplicate. I jinxed myself, but again, I have a few friends who are buying this album and so I am not too worried. And if they do pull the same ones, they'll go off on my Instagram account eventually. Um, and then one, two, three. Ooh, I love this one. It's so playful. Okay, this one's probably one of my favorites other than like the black and white. These are these two, these two are like my fave. Okay, awesome. Um, and then we have the CD. So that one's really nice as well. I'm glad they, ooh, oh, they chose like one with like the photography. However, the um, typography kind of covered it, which meh. Not a fan of that, but yeah, so that is the jewel case where the CD comes. We'll move you over again. Here we go. Then we can look at the pre order benefits again. Same exact thing. I wish they kind of did different pre order benefits, especially because they were on pack, like in the album. They kind of could have done something a little different for each one, maybe. That's just me, but so there are those. Or I don't know why I'm taking them off camera or off out of frame. So there you go, there's those. Um, and now we can look at the little tag. So here we go. We have the little blue and red tag part. There we go. Ooh, cute. So yes, we have a little bit of cleavage, <laughs> but I don't mind. Um, and there is the back. So yeah, again, not a huge fan of little tag things like this that come in albums lately, but it's not bad. And then for the final photo card, come here. One, two, three. Oh, I'm gonna cry, it's so cute. I love it. Ah, okay, beautiful. I'm so happy with my pulls. I kind of wish I got more variety in postcards, but photo cards were like phenomenal. And then, oh, that's the cover for this album. Love it, great choice. So yeah, let me pull, I guess, everything back into frame and then we can do a quick little outro. Okay, and there you have it. That is everything that I pulled in my Sumu albums. Um, I'm so happy with everything that I got. A couple duplicates with the postcards, but honestly, not too worried. This album is so well designed. It's so beautiful. It came with so many cute things. And um, yeah, I'm so glad to finally own it. And if you haven't listened to this album yet, please, please, please do. 
Anyways, thank you so much for watching everyone. I hope you enjoyed. Bye-bye.